tic-tac-toe. The thing you scribble down in those boring math lectures from the ancient Egypt and Rome. They drew these on the walls and played it on the grounds with the stones. But now, today in a world of colonized knots and crosses, these guys named Neville and Simon who are awarded for setting the base for artificial intelligence in 1972 compiled every move in tic-tac-toe. It makes sense if you read about them because I am not going to explain human psychology when you have Patrick Bateman on your mind the whole time. Yes, I basically read the Wikipedia article but you are too lazy to read that anyway so you are forced to listen to me. First we have the block which makes you feel smart. Empty corner which just places a move in the corner. Opposite corner which just places a move the th players move in the opposite corner. Empty side and center where you are all alone while your opponent sleeps on your boring playstyles. Well, there's no playstyles anyway. And then there's win the thing that makes you feel power over your opponent while you both are on an empty mind between the class and risk of being caught then you have the four this is the most torture you can experience in any tic-tac-toe game you can only cry in pain while your opponent laughs in the distance you feel all your life crumbling before your eyes while you contemplate of what you had done to get into this situation while you take your last breath on making a move your soul's last battle withers away as you see your opponent achieve victory well, of course, then you have blocking the fog, which are just some precautionary moves to prevent a fog in between. But uh, doing that, you'll probably lose anyway. Yes. Now that you know all about the tactics of this game, it's time to throw that out of the window because in the perfect game, a biblically accurate tic tac toe, if you would say, the first player always wins if they play the move in the center. So, you have that. You might just get bored of this simple game over and over. So there's variations of it like wild tic-tac-toe where both players have control over both knots and crosses. Doesn't make sense, I don't think it's supposed to even. Then you get into 3D tic-tac-toe. Fucking number tic-tac-toe? What tic-tac-toe? And yeah, fucking quantum tic-tac-toe. I need help. Uh, oh yeah, this SOS tic tac toe too. I yeah. There are official tic tac toe tournaments, just like everything else. And like, just tic tac toe isn't that complicated. Neither are there obnoxious jokes made on it. When it comes to bots in chess, you usually get boarded by whichever you battle. But in tic tac toe, it's usually a draw. As a tic-tac-toe player who has been playing since he was born and before, my ego is stroked every time I win a game. Now because my notebook is filled with tic-tac-toe again, I have failed my exams once again. Shit. Help yourself!